Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel and welcome to episode 4 of my Madden NFL 19 series. After a long stay in Texas taking on the Cowboys and the Texans, Joe Nero and his New York Giants are back here at home ready to take on the New Orleans Saints. I've got to tell you guys, I'm a bit concerned about this matchup here, right? Because Drew Brees is not to be messed with. He's one of the best quarterbacks of all time. He has a very good offense and so far here in our season, he is 2-1. So, I think it's going to be a pretty good game. I have a feeling it's going to be another shootout, and I'm concerned I won't be able to keep up with Drew Brees and his offense. But, of course, if you caught the last episode, then you saw a pretty high-octane offense out of this New York Giants football team. So, hopefully, we can replicate some of that success here in today's episode. But, ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank you guys so much for tuning in today. Thank you so much for all the support we've had so far here in the series. I apologize for there not being an episode over the course of the past couple of days. If you guys follow my main channel, Nero Cinema, you know I have been incredibly busy with the blackout beta which is definitely a lot of fun all right so the plan today is to play our game i'm not gonna try and force the deep ball we had what did obj have in the previous game like 261 yards i'm not gonna try and force that i'm gonna go back to our game which of course is short passes and running the football and letting plays develop that's what I'm trying to do here today. If he's open, he's open. But I'm not just going to start bombing the ball downfield like I did in the previous episode. Because let's be honest, that probably won't work again. But then again, it might. We'll have to see what that free safety wants to do. He's kind of bumped up right now, honestly. They're definitely in a zone coverage right now, I feel like. We're going to run. We're going to run the football here. We're going to trust Saquon Barkley and our offensive line. Look at them go. That's why we trust Saquon Barkley. I feel like... The running back AI going from last year's Madden to this year's Madden has gotten much better. Like, it seems like when you hand the ball off to an AI player, maybe it's because I'm playing on all Madden, I really don't know. But instead of just going north-south and, like, you know, taking one or two yards every single time, they actually cut outside and try to, you know, beat the opposing team with their legs, which I actually really like. And wide open. I mean, that play, we run that play a lot, but honestly, it's always there. It just, why why wouldn't we run it if it's always going to be open? Here, oh, let's see. Okay, they're definitely in zone, but I think Shepard or maybe even OBJ might be open here if we actually have time. If they're blitzing, it may have an issue. Uh, we're good. And wide open. Like I said, man, if they're in zone coverage, that crossing route's going to work every time. Oh, no. Not Sterling. He's the good Shepard. We do have a backup Shepard, but I like that one. <laughs> I like Sterling over Russell. He's much better. Mm. When they show him going off the sidelines like that, it's usually a... Hopefully he can come back. I'm hoping, because he's the guy that caught that game-winning touchdown for us, which I still can't believe actually happened. Uh... Okay, we're going to go tight end seams. Parby wants to really try the tight end seams here and see if we can get Engram down the field. Then another part of me wants to run, but it looks like they're going to be blitzing. So let's look for him. If he's not there, OBJ should be there. And he's wide open. I lobbed it up to him. I love that. I love that he's actually like, I don't know, just lobbing the ball up like that just feels really satisfying when they jump up and catch it. Very good. He's got three catches so far this game. Let's go for an actual run play, though. I want to get the run game involved. I don't want to abandon that so early. Usually, I've noticed there's a trend in all of my Madden series. I always, like, start the series off by trying to run the football as much as I can. And then I get comfortable. I get comfortable with the pass protection. I get comfortable with the different routes and the plays and the playbook. And I start throwing the ball constantly. And sometimes that's bad for the team. So I'm going to try my best to keep a good balance here for the entire series. I like the idea of Engram again. I mean, if they're sending that blitz... Barkley, uh, can you block for me, bud? I'm actually... <laughs> I don't want to get hit. Uh, we may hit Gallup here on the outside, but we're looking for Engram to begin with. All right, they're covering Engram this time. Wide open, coming across. Oh! Yo, he actually may have been able to get away from that hit. Let's go for a halfback dive. Uh, with the way that hit happened, he could have maybe landed on his feet, and that would have been hilarious. All right, Barkley, I believe in you, bud. There you go. Good blocking. Who's that, Beckin? Beckton? I can't, I can't read his last name. Whoever that lineman was, very good blocking. Uh, ooh, the stick and nod. I really like the stick and nod here. Oh, but it's my backup tight end that's in. Mm. I suddenly like this a lot less knowing it's my backup tight end. We'll see. I feel like Ellison might be there. If not, we'll have OBJ probably. Okay, uh, we're going OBJ. I wanted to wait for Ellison maybe, but we'll go OBJ. It's hard to not go OBJ. Let's do a hurry up offense. This defense can't stop us right now. What are they going to do? 
Jonathan Stewart's about to run all over them. All right, I'm not, they're actually stuffed in the box, but Jonathan Stewart doesn't care. <laughs> okay, maybe he should care. <laughs> okay, ah. Uh, I like the tight end mid attack here, and we'll maybe we'll maybe look for a run play. We have Ingram back in. I mean, it could be there. It could definitely be there. Uh, let's have OBJ on a slant, and Gallup. Can we just like send you deep or something? Just get you out of the way. Let's see. Uh, he's not gonna be there. Wide open. Good catch. He actually held on to that. Sick. Okay, I actually thought he was gonna drop that. OBJ is a really good player, but it seems like. Even though his stats say he shouldn't, it seems like he drops a lot of those passes. Uh, do we have a two tight end set? I need two tight ends. Two tight ends game. All right, there we go. Quick slants. I want two tight ends so I can audible it into a halfback blunt dive. I fully trust. I, oh, look at the defense, too. Look how the linebackers push back. I fully believe Saquon Barkley is scoring right here. Oh, come on, dude. Hurry up, offense. Hurry up, offense. Come on. No field goals. No field goals here today. Tired of field goals. All right. Do we actually try running this? I, I believe in Saquon. I do. Like, we have to want it more than them. Let's get it, guys. Let's get it. Ah, it was, it was a good call. I could have went for a pass play, but I feel like that was a good call because what's the worst thing that's going to happen? I mean, Drew Brees, while he is good, his offense has to go 95 yards here. Like, I, I feel like we're just going to get the ball right back. Let's see. All right, we got the ball back, 25-yard line. So really no harm, no foul. It's a very anticlimactic way to end off the first drive and end off the first quarter, but it's okay. Maybe I should have went with a three. I don't know. I really, I just felt like we should have had that, you know? Like, we had so much momentum. Oh, there you go. Saquon, no. Keep going, dude. Very nice. Um, Let's go for a slant. I just, I want to get the run game involved. I want to get Saquon his touchdowns, and I wouldn't have called it if I didn't think it was going to work. Uh, let's go for a power row. What was that, what was that lineman doing? He's actually lined up out there at, like, corner for a bit. Let's just run again. Ah. Uh, oh, Saquon! Saquon Barkley! That's why we give him the ball, ladies and gentlemen! 70 yards! <laughs> Apologies, my voice is already shy. I live streamed for, like, four hours today. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I can't believe that, dude! <laughs> Look at him go, dude. I haven't even been looking. Is Shepard back in? I love this offense. I love this Giants offense, man. <laughs> I can't believe that, man. 70-yard touchdown run. Welcome to the league. And we get the ball back. But keep in mind, we get the ball back on our one-yard line. Please, I dare you. Please bump up your safeties. They're not going to. I was going to straight up try and go for a 99-yard touchdown pass. But instead, we're going to run the football. No, Saquon, you go north-south, buddy. You do not cut outside when we're on the one-yard line. <laughs> Crying out loud here. Uh, ooh, ace wide receiver stretch. They're playing too far back. They're playing far, way too far back. But I think... Let's send Engram on straight up out. I like Gallup here, actually. If that safety covers Engram, Gallup should be really open. Uh, Gallup's gonna be very open. Oh, almost intercepted. I threw it behind it. In. Wow. <laughs> what a play that was. That was. Whew. That could have been very bad. That could have been very. Oh, let's go four wide. Let's go four wide. So they learned their lesson. They did their scouting. They are not letting OBJ get open deep. They are. They are refusing. But now nah, it's looking like Sterling still hurt. We still have Russell though. Uh, Lewis Jr., do you want to be a hero? Straight up, straight up, just get that play, man. Just get it. Just get open downfield. That's all I got to do. And, uh, I mean, he was actually going to be open, I feel like, downfield, but Cameron Jordan got through. Cameron Jordan's such a good player. Uh, he hasn't been a real factor so far, but he got through really quickly right there. Oh, I guess now uh, would be a great time to ask you guys. How is your fantasy team doing? I mean, obviously, when you draft your team, you're like, yeah, this team's great. Then week one happens, and you're like, oh. My team's actually doing pretty well. I lost my first game, but we it was a it was a shootout, like an absolute shootout. Um, he had Tyreek Hill, 
and so he won. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it was, a, it was a pretty good matchup for me. All right, and nope, no hitterino. Oh, oh, Joe Nero breaking tackles here. And let's do a hurry up. Can we do a hurry up into like a slant play of sorts? Uh, the tight end drive will be fine. We'll just call that again. It's it's been there the majority of the game. It'll probably be here again. And wide open backup tight end cross the line, bud. Uh, I see. I ooh, we have an injury. Is that a lineman? I think it's a lineman. I considered waiting for him, right? But he was so open. But you gotta keep in mind, like it's something. It's, it's a mental error on my part. My backup tight end's not gonna be that fast. And so when he caught that ball, there was a very little chance of him like making a big play downfield or anything you know i should have realized that that was a bad that was a bad decision on my part but i'm learning i'm learning all right they're playing back a lot if they blitz these slants are going to be very open and they're not blitzing oh joe slide there we go uh let's do a hurry up i like hurry up into the ghost here man i re oh come on they are bumping up those safeties on us OBJ one on one, of course not. It's never OBJ one on one, but we have Evan Ingram, and they're, I'm ten of ten for hundred yards. You can't make that up. I'm about to be ten of eleven though, because we're spiking it. We have a minute left, which is actually a lot of time in Madden time, but you know it's it, it's fine. I'll spike, stop the clock, let my team recoup a little bit, and find us a good play. And maybe take a good shot downfield. We'll see. Definitely not a screen. Definitely not going down that route. Uh, halfback option. I used to love this play back in the older Madden games. I think it was one of those plays I was like bugged or something. Because the running back was always open on the out route. Like how many of you guys did the same thing? Like the halfback option was always there. Uh, Shepard, can I have you do a slant? There you go. I'm just trying to create separation for OBJ potentially. And... Oh, I'm dead. Yep. I didn't make a quick enough decision. I thought the scramble. As soon as I thought the scramble, bam, I took the hit. <sighs> Third and 21. We need, to put, but we need to put more points here, man. I don't like only being one touchdown ahead of Drew Brees. Oh, coach. Coach, you don't believe in my offense. Sitting here telling me to run. Mm -mm. We're taking a shot downfield here. Depending on the coverage. And that's OBJ in a one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, screw OBJ. We've got him. Oh, that's picked. You know why it was picked? One, because I was his I threw. But mostly, mostly because I had to stop and like come. I'm right-handed. I was running to the left. I had to basically turn my entire body. And that took a lot of momentum off my throw. And now they're definitely going to score. That's rough, man. That's rough. But it's okay. It's okay. We're just going to run the ball here. End off the first half, seven to seven. It's like it's like the first half never happened, uh, score wise. We're fine. We are fine here, man. Oh, Saquon Barkley. Ooh, going for the strip there. Let's call a timeout. Now, I should really not take a shot downfield here. I should really not do that. But uh, we 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 may do that. We'll see. OBJ, they're in bump and run, OBJ. Uh, Shepard's have you run a slants. Gallup will send you deep. We'll see if you can do anything. And then Barkley, can you just like pass block for me? I just, I don't like being hit. It's not my favorite thing. Uh, oh, oh, I shouldn't run against him. Let's see. We have six seconds. One timeout. They want, okay, Hail Mary is a dumb... All right, come on, coach. Hail Mary is a stupid play. We all know it's a dumb play. Uh, hmm. So if I were to go... Okay, so that's a goofy formation. Can I get a regular? There we go. If I were to go with a formation like this, right? And find some sort of a quick slants play to an inside receiver, such as Russell, Sh R Russell Shepard. That's a tongue twister. We may actually be able to get in field goal range. And there's Russ. Get up there, bud. And timeout. We had two seconds left. What would that be? That's uh, 50, uh, 13, 53 yards? That's only 53 yards, right? Right? I did that math right? 37. It was it seven yards for the snap. I think you take whatever field position you're on. Then you add. I've already forgotten this. Is it add 17? I think you add 17 to it. So 54 yards. Right? 
Let's see. And we made it! <laughs> Let's check the stats really quick, man. That's actually awesome. Okay, so the kicker, I just want to make sure I did all the math right, and that actually is 17 yards. I used to know this. Why am I forgetting it today? Yeah, 54 yards. So, uh, whatever uh, yard line you're on, if you're wondering how long of a field goal it's going to be, add 17 to it. You have to, it's basically seven yards for the snap, for where the, you know, the placeholder holds onto the ball, and then 10 yards, of course, for the entire length of the end zone. 54 yards. My man. All right, so now that we have the lead... And oh wait, I'm, I'm in my own formation here. Now that we have the lead and the ball here to start the second half, let's go back to our offense, man. Let's go back to just you know short passes, running the football, feeding Saquon Barkley. Uh, cut this to the left so we don't have to deal with uh, Jordan there. Break it. Oh, there you go. Ten carries, 105 yards. That feels good, man. Feels real good to have a running back that can actually you know do things. Let's take control right away. Yeah, you think we're good right now. Keep in mind, my quarterback's like a 60-something overall. And Barkley's like an 80-something overall. This team's only going to get better. It's only going to get better. OBJ is still really young. We're going to go for another halfback dive here. I may audible out of it, but I feel like a dive here is the best play. Never mind. All right. Going tight end attack. And Ellison, can I be run like a normal in? That's all we need. And... Open. I love Engram. What? Can they show Engram's stats, please? I'm 13 and 14. My one incompletions. Uh, five catches for 70. Wait, did my spike not count as an incomplete pass? Don't spikes count as incomplete passes? I guess, I guess not, unless they change that rule, or maybe... I don't know. I don't know about this, boys. I don't know about all this. We're going to send OBJ deep, and then Engram on out. I think they're blitzing here, but I want to see what that safety does. All right, safety's going back. OBJ's going to beat. OBJ. Ah, oh, He had him beat, so I tried throwing it to the inside where he can make a play on the ball, but no such luck. If I would have called a different play, like a like the crossing route that we ran to Shepard earlier, if we would have had one of those right there, that would have tore apart that entire defense. But uh, it wasn't one of the options for the audible, so no such luck. Uh, inside cross? I mean, they want to go for the same thing. This play should actually... This play will actually exploit that quite a bit, but they're definitely in zone coverage now. But that's fine. We can look for Engram deep. If not, uh, we're going to go for OBJ, I think. And I can actually... Oh, he's got he's gotten beat already. We're going underneath. Look at him go, dude! That's my fullback, for crying out loud. That's the man that caught my first ever NFL pass. Now we're going to go for a run play here on third and one. We're going to cut this to the left where there's virtually nobody there to stop us. And uh, come on, Barkley. I feel like if, you, if he would have hit the, hit the hole a little bit harder there, he would have actually gotten a big gain. But that's fine. That's fine. Uh, inside cross again. Same idea pretty much. We're going to see if maybe ha if uh, he's going to get through right away. No, he didn't. We're going underneath the fullback again. Why is that so open? Why are you leaving my fullback so open? And halfback lead dive, man. They, they can't beat this formation right now. They straight up can't beat it. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, flanker dig. Oh, Engram. Dude, Engram, one of these two are about to be open. And bad idea. Bad idea. Oh. I saw something. That's Here's the life lesson for Madden for you guys, man. I saw something in the defense. I thought it would work. And instead of actually waiting for it to develop or actually waiting for it to work, I tried forcing it because I just was so sure it had to work. It wasn't going to. You know, adjust. Look, look for it. Look for a check down receiver. You know, don't don't be dumb like I just was. All right, we're looking for Ellison on the crossing route here, and wide open. Ah, Ellison! You'll never be a starter in this league if you drop those. You're my backup, man. Come on, don't you want to be a starter? That was, I can make the argument for that being a fumble, honestly. All right, so this should be a good field goal. I mean, if you made the last one, he should make this one. It's shorter. And he made it. There we go. Good job. And we get the ball back. Why is our defense randomly stupidly good? Like, for no reason. Like, I could have swore the reason why the Giants weren't going to be all that good is because of their defense. But it seems like the defense is doing really good. Maybe it's because we're taking so long with our drives that we're just keeping Drew Brees off the field. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. 
<laughs> Maybe it's because we're keeping Drew Brees off the field and he doesn't really have a lot of time to get anything going. I don't know, man. Oh, dude. Saquon Barkley. I love Saquon Barkley. Uh, I wanted the Browns to get him so bad. Oh, by the way, my Cleveland Browns tied the Pittsburgh Steelers. You'd think I'd be happy about that. I mean, I guess I'm happy the Browns didn't lose. But if you watch the game, then you know the Browns should have won that game. There was like five different opportunities they had to win the game. And by the way, I'm going to get super greedy here. I'm going to look for Ingram underneath if, it, if it's not there. But I really want to see if OBJ can beat that corner. And he did. And he did. Now, but here's the thing. I don't have the... Oh, he actually caught that? No way. <laughs> My quarterback doesn't have that much throw power. My throw power is like 86 or something. You know, it, it, it's not very good. Wow. Right between two. Wow. That was... I just told you guys not to make stupid decisions like I... Do as I say, not as I do. Please. <laughs> wow, look how many yards we have compared to the Saints. We have we have almost 400 yards of offense here, and the Saints have like 200. And we're going to run against them. Saquon Barkley, dude. My favorite thing about Saquon is he doesn't really go down after the first hit. If he gets hit in the backfield, he doesn't care. He just keeps going. Oh, come on. That's a touchdown, too, but I'll bet you it's holding. Everyone's booing, so it's got to be holding. That's how you can tell. Uh, it's all right. e -rec. I bet you it's Eric, but it's, it's spelled e -rec, which is weird. I never saw Eric spelled that way before. Come on, man. Well, now... Oh, the crowd is so mad. But that's okay. We're about to liven up that crowd with a touchdown pass to Ingram here. I love this play. I really do. I think Ingram's going to be there. And there he is. Oh, dude, that's a fumble. Turn around, grab the ball, dude. No. Pantan OBJ's got him. Manti Tao and his fake girlfriend aren't about to get away from us. Come on, OBJ, grab him. He was so open, too, dude. Like, you guys didn't see, Engram was wide open. Like, wide open. And by the way, now they have the ball like this and they score a touchdown, they're winning. They're up by one if they score a touchdown here. And they do. Are we, about, are we about to throw this game away, guys? Are we about to throw this game away? No, we're going to run the football. <laughs> we're going to look to run that football, and that's going to help us out a lot, I think. Oh, I can't believe that, dude. Fumbles are so frustrating because they're kind of like out of your control. It's like it's like RNG. It's like you're going to get hit. Oh, dude, go upfield. Look at him go, dude. It's like RNG, you know? You can't really control if you're going to fumble. You can sometimes control if you're going to get hit, but right there, it was kind of hard to control whether or not I was going to get hit. They just kind of flew right through and took me out, you know? And then I fumble, and then they return for that far. Oh, man. That's rough. That's all Madden for you, boys. Looking for Ingram here, if it isn't obvious enough. Uh, nope. Throw the weight. Throw the weight. That animation. That animation. That's intentional grounding, but... Yeah. <laughs> that animation, though. All right. So what goes from an easy third and five becomes a an incredibly difficult third and 18. Everyone's booing, as they should be, man. We went from having a guaranteed touchdown to, be, to losing by one and then potentially punting the ball off to them. And let's see. And they got right through. Didn't have time to scramble or make a play or anything. They lost uh, D. Davis. I'm not sure who that is. Someone got injured on their team. Now we have to punt. Now Drew Brees is coming back on the field. And our defense is held. Good job, D. Great job. All right. Uh, what do we do here, guys? I want to go like to a regular... Why does Coach want me to be bombing the ball downfield here, man? I just, I just want to run the football. All right. I think the OBJ is going to be here. We'll see. I think he is, though. Nope, they're dropping everybody back. Oh, my gosh. Can I get some blocking? There we go. Block for me, bud. Get field. Ooh, big hit. That's okay. The big hit's fine because I, uh, you know, the ball was in my left hand. I was right on the sideline. Even if I fumbled, it would have went out of bounds. I've noticed you don't, you don't seem to fumble as much as a quarterback uh, when you're scrambling like that. It's only, like, when you get sacked that you seem to fumble. I don't know. 
Ooh, guys. All right, uh, Barkley, I need you full-on pass blocking here because OBJ should be open on this crossing route if the pass protection holds up, which it has. Get No, dude! Why did you? No! No! I wanted to lead him a lot more than that. And it just threw way short. Really short. And our defense held. Not only did our defense... What? I think they turned the ball over. They did. Oh my goodness, dude. You can't make this stuff up. All right. Come on, man. We need we need some solid we need some solid yards out of you, Barkley. I am making some really dumb decisions right now, throwing really dumb passes. Right now, okay. So here's the thing, guys. Right. We are in control of our own destiny. We usually are, but we. I mean, our our kicker has proven that he really doesn't miss. Like he just doesn't. And so, as a result, if we just drive downfield, still leave it surely, and go for three, we're good. That's all we really need is three. And we're almost already in field goal range. We're almost already there. They have all their timeouts, but if we can just get, like, ten yards, ten more yards, that's all we really need to boot that three, and we're, and we're, and we're set. We're solid. Uh, nervous, though. Not going to lie, guys. They are bumping up everybody, but I think we're okay with this, though. There's Saquon. Look at him, dude. He doesn't go down after the first hit. He just doesn't. He just doesn't. If I were the if, if I were the Saints, I'd be uh, I'd be calling a timeout right about now. I don't, I don't know what, what, what they're doing right now. But I'm going to call my own formation here. Single back, two tight end. Halfback blunt dive to the left. I mean... I feel like they should be using their timeouts <laughs> because I'm gonna run that clock down. I'm not playing for a touchdown, guys. I'm playing for I'm playing for three. Let's run the ball here. Come on, good blocks, good blocks. Okay, terrible blocks. Terrible blocks there towards the end. Now we have to go for a quick slant. It's hard to play for three from this range, though. And how? Okay, thank you, Madden. The game had me sacked before I was even hit. Are you kidding me? The game had me sacked before I was even hit. Like, I was being stood up and unable to control my character, even though I was just standing there looking stupid. That was dumb. I'm not happy about that. Uh, Engram, can I be going downfield, bud? All right, Engram's there. They're covering pretty much everybody. After all that. After all that, dude, I even had my tight end extra blocking. We only had three receivers going out, and they only sent four people, and they still got through. It had to happen eventually. It had to happen eventually. Joe Nero's first NFL loss. I'm really frustrated with how it happened. Like, we could have won that game. We had the game actually won. But then, really bad decisions, and a bad penalty, and bad, bad blocking, and we lost it. <sighs> That's one of those ones where, when I go back and watch the footage from this episode, I'm, I'm going to see so many little things, so many little mistakes that I made, and think to myself, I should have won that game. I should have won it. We, we started the season off 3-0, though, which is pretty great, but uh, man, just, we, we should have won. You should have won the game. But you can't win them all, I suppose. Let's check out the stats. I mean, I had a good game. It just, anytime I threw an incompletion, it was very costly. Like, my two interceptions really hurt us there. I was actually outplaying Drew Brees. Look at that, dude. Bare completion percentage. He did have two touchdowns, but I had, you know, I, I was doing better than him, mostly. And then running the ball, Saquon was killing it. Absolutely killing it. But we kept having costly mistakes stopping us from scoring. And that ruined it for us. Engram, six catches, 78 yards, three for 56 for OBJ. I'm so, I can't believe I threw that pick uh, earlier on him. Uh, Gallup, a two for 20. Uh, Shane Smith, my full pack randomly. Ru Russell Shepard uh, filling in for Sterling, which hopefully Sterling's not hurt for too long, man. I would hate to lose him. <sighs> I'm kicking myself after that one, man. I am kicking myself. Defense played so well. 
We had every opportunity to win, but I messed up. But that's what happens when you're a rookie in the NFL. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much for tuning in to this episode of the Madden NFL 19 playthrough. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please drop me a rating, and I hope you guys all have a wonderful day. 